the Road Show this morning in the buzz brought to you by the Comedy Connection. Halloween is behind us, so we would like to be the first ones to wish you a very Merry Christmas. It is now November, so the, the big debate is on. Mm -hmm. Do you take down that inflatable ghost on the lawn and put up your Christmas lights? See, no matter where you stand on the issue, the end of the year is coming quickly. In fact, we have a countdown to share with you right now that our web department put together. So here we go. Five days until we turn the clocks back. Okay. 23 days until Thanksgiving. 50 days until the start of winter. 54 days until Christmas. Got it. And 61 until 2023. And look, I mean, I think after you, we, after we like we begin November 1st today, it yep. will go by in the blink of an eye. It just it just happens. Well, that's why. I mean, those five events are like you said, they're going to come and go right. so quickly. So I understand wanting to enjoy the season for yes. as long as you can. Right. However, I was trying to do something yesterday that involved getting a bag of candy corn. Mm -hmm. So I went to Target and the entire section that was Halloween was already Christmas. Oh, and no. all I thought was, can you let it have its day? Yeah, I agree. You were selling stuff leading up to like, can you let it have its day? I agree. And then fully transition. Sure. Like there's been sprinklings and an aisle here and there. And you can tell, cause it's a lot on these employees too, right? right? right. Like they got to get everything stocked yes. and like the turnover is so quickly sure. because there are so many of us on a day like today, they're like, I want everything Christmas. I need to buy mm -hmm. new decorations and an extra tree and right. all that other stuff. Yeah, and, and I'm fine. Look, if you're if you're going out and you see a Christmas tree or something like that, right? And, and, and it's, it's a good deal. And it's a good deal. I say go for it. Or if you see something, I mean, with with the way things have been, if you see something that is on sale, Ooh, there not may not be, be that many of them. I'm all for that too. Just pick it up, mm -hmm. buy it, put it someplace where you're not going to forget where it is. Right. And and get it for that person. I told you too. There's like this new energy and magic about the holidays oh, having course. kids having sure. young kids absolutely and i'm a sucker for it i really am but and, that's what and you're supposed to do exactly but i'm not going to put the the christmas decorations up yet right. will i buy stuff it's not going to deter me from like you said if i see something cool get oh it. i'm going to get that right put it away because when it's time i'll take everything out sure believe you me when Halloween is done and that meal is over I'm already kind of taking down the decorations mm -hmm. because Black Friday comes and I want the place decorated right, for Christmas right, right. yes based on that countdown too we have less than a month mm -hmm. in between the holidays sometimes it works out that that way right and and yeah it's like there's, there's not enough time to do everything that you want to do yes. yes when is the proper time to hear Mariah are we giving her a little time? She needs to be further into the All right, the month. No, look, I agree with that as well. I'm, I mean, I'm with you we're, on that too. we're still, Brendan, it's like we're not even I taking agree. out the heavy jackets yet. It's really hard to like be driving with the windows down and listening to Christmas. The weather's going to no? be so nice. You could go sit at the beach this weekend. It's going to be beautiful out. Look, I still haven't even, I said this already on the show, I haven't even taken down my Labor Day decorations. Well, yes, and they're quite extensive. <laughs> look, it's early. I think after Thanksgiving is the appropriate time mm. to start with the, the holiday themed music. Sure. and to really start decorating. Mm -hmm. However, look, people to each their own. I'm mm -hmm. not the expert. I just play one right here on the television. Right. <laughs> but yeah, it's fun. People want to have some fun. And Michaela, you made such a good point. You have a renewed appreciation for the holidays yeah. now, but it is kind of early. Yeah. It is, but I'm not... I'm not going to get mad if I drive by Christmas lights because it is some, they look so magical they at do. night. Mm -hmm. If someone has their house decked out, it's, sure, sure, it's I nice. do enjoy it's nice. it. I, I, it's just a little I just won't do it yet. Yeah. Right. Yeah, I'm going to take down those Labor Day decorations this week. Good and idea. I'll take Good the idea. <laughs> right. Let's check in with our viewers, see what you guys had to say about this topic right here this morning on Lay Road Show. <laughs> <laughs> speak parlez-vous français all of a sudden this morning. James says, I'm not one for the holiday, so this is definitely not my favorite time of year. Yeah, it's not for everybody, you know. Everyone has their own thoughts on this and how they handle it and navigate the season. Anne-Marie thinks, it's too soon for Christmas. Everyone keeps skipping over Thanksgiving. I start my Christmas decorations the weekend after Thanksgiving. I'm right there with you, Anne-Marie. I think that's the ideal time. Uh, Anne says, after Thanksgiving, I start playing my Christmas music. Again, right there, I, I agree with you. And lastly, Sharon directs her comment toward Will. Oh, I hope he's paying attention. Will, you say that Thanksgiving is no pressure. So who's doing all the cooking and cleaning at Shea Gilbert? Well, <laughs> Will. Uh, that would not be me. <laughs> exactly, Sharon. Guilty as charged. Thanks for chiming in, everyone. We love when you're a part of the show. Please follow us at The Road Show on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Leave your thoughts on our daily live buzz topic. We go on Facebook about quarter of eight. Leave your comments, and you never know. We might read them right here on the show and still to come. Are you ready? <laughs> Those Lego masters 
continue to amaze us. And we will hear from host Will Arnett, Will Arnett, about the latest builds. <laughs> Will Arnett. <laughs>